Sometimes when you find a thin ribbon of dirt heading off toward the unknown, you just have to climb on your dirt bike and see where it goes. And today on At Your Leisure, that's exactly what we're doing. Join Chad and me as we hit a single track trail that is deceptively close to your backyard. Then you'll want to get your passport ready and follow me, Zach Cipriano, as I take you on a Far East adventure that is every bit about the food as it is about the exploration. Finally, we'll see what happens when you shrink a rock crawler. Own the outdoors with At Your Leisure. <laughs> You know, Darren, you and I both have some reputation to lose today. <laughs> well, as long as it's just reputation and not skin or bone. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, everybody. Welcome to At Your Leisure today. I'm Chad Booth. And I'm Darren Kinder, and we're out here in Tooele County, and we're going to go do a little single track riding today. That's right. I'm, I'm a little rusty on the single track skills. My last single track I actually gave to him and then he gave it away. <laughs> and, so, and so we're just uh, doing the community a favor by getting us both off the trail. <laughs> <laughs> so we don't totally obliterate ourselves out here getting back on single track. We actually have some coaches and guides. It's the Stedman boys. It's David and Brandon from Stedman's. They're out here in Tooele. This is their back country. They're going to help us get through it today. Yeah, there's probably no rock out here they haven't turned over. So we're falling off. Yeah, and uh, hopefully they have the. Uh, speed dial to EMS. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, I think they're the ones who can tell you best about this trail. We're in Davenport Canyon right now. We've got the Stansbury Front Trail right behind us. The most northern point is behind the Walmart Distribution Center in Grantsville. So you could come up the road and head it there, go all the way south to Rush Valley Clover area. It is all single tracks, so it's motorcycle only, but so much recreation out here. We have the desert, we have the mountains. I've grown up, ride single track all my life. You know, I remember coming out here with Bruce and Nolan. I was in junior high and I had my motorcycle on the top of Deseret Peak. There's a very good map that Tooele County has made up. It does all of Tooele County. There's some hiking trails on it that aren't accessible by motorcycles. There's some ATV trails on it, single track trails on it, and some horse stuff too. A uh, very good map of Tooele County. You got the Stansberries over here, the Ochre Mountains over there. Lots of good maps. You come out and see us at Stedman's, we can get you a, a map there at Stedman's. Uh, you can get it online or Tooele County. I'm sure you can go up to the county and get it too. The magic of single track to me is I love to ride a dirt bike. I'd much rather sit on a dirt bike than sit in a side-by-side -side or an ATV. You don't have a big road. You're cutting through the trees nice and tight. It's gorgeous. Sometimes I wish my wife would get on the back and just go once just to show it to her, but that'll never happen. So yeah, single track's awesome because you're in the tight trees and switch back. Some challenging stuff sometimes, you know, uh, but it's, it's a lot of fun, you know. It's always fun to get the challenging stuff and see who makes it and who doesn't it. It's always glory to go back and help the other guys. You know, this Stansberry Front Trail is absolutely a blast because, you know, what makes it a little bit different is that you're in the trees and you're smelling the pines and all of that stuff, and it really is a lot of fun. And every time I come out to Tooele, I seem to find something else to come out here and do that I can't believe how beautiful this trail is. Well, right now we need to get to our travel adventure and Zach has got something a little different for you to see. Well, welcome back to At Your Leisure. I'm here with the Stedmans and we're out here in Tooele County, which is your guys' backyard. Is there any rock out here you haven't turned over, Dave? You know, there's a few of them that weren't on the trail, but you know, <laughs> most of the ones on the trail have all been rolled over a few times. You notice they're all round? Yeah, I know. They've been tumbled like the river. I about got myself tumbled a few times well, on that. Well, you know, but... we always know where them spots are, so we always stop to watch to see, but you did real good. I didn't, I didn't see the grips in the ground. The tires stayed on the ground. So I, that's, we, I we can't did real good. keep the rubber down, you know, that's what, that's what they say, but it's been a lot of fun. Brandon, you've been kind of coaching me along, getting me through the hard parts. So I appreciate that. And uh, you know, that there is a lot of things to do out here, isn't there? Oh man, Tool County's got all kinds of things to do. Off-road, dirt bike, ATV, UTVs, you know. We are on single track today, 
but there's a lot of other options and a lot of other areas to ride a dirt bike also. That's awesome. Well, let's take a look at a few of those other places. I think it's just such a great place because it's not quite as big as Salt Lake, so you, you can just take up off the hills and just go right anywhere, basically. There's another fun single track up Middle Canyon. It's called uh, White Pine Loop. It's actually a loop you'll go up by Butterfield Canyon and the trailhead starts about there. And it'll take you kind of in the foothills of the Rocky Basin, whatever, over there. There's easy parts to it that I can play around with, go fast, and there's also technical places that to this day, I still crash on myself, so it challenges me as a rider. I, I enjoy viewing the scenery just so I know the area. And there's also, it's not single track, but over by Jacob City, Stockton area, there's a lot of dirt bike stuff you can do over there too, which you can also do on a side-by-side -side or an ATV as well. In dirt biking, you have a lot of your track people and you have your trail people as well. So Desert Peak is kind of basically the Tula County Fairgrounds now, and so they have all sorts of activities going on, plus the motocross track. But what's cool about the track down there is it's groomed every day that it's open, so it's a good track and it accommodates to all levels of riders. When Tula County got the funding, we actually built the motocross track down there, and over the years, we as Stedmans and Tula County have been improving the track to accommodate for better conditions and a better experience for all the riders. Single track, you kind of got to pay more attention what you're doing. It's a little more technical in some places because you don't have as much as give area. Single track, you got this much you're on versus an ATV trail, you got 50, 60 inches. You got some leeway if you make a mistake. People shouldn't be scared because yes, you do feel more stable on a four-wheeler. Dirt bike, I feel you respect a little more. Once you get the feel and comfortable with it, you can begin to push your limits and fill it out in a different way. As you can see, there are lots of options when it comes to dirt bikes and motorized recreation in Tooele County. And it goes from north, south to east and west everywhere. Well, right now it's time for us to turn our attention to our trailhead adventure brought to you each week by RockyMountainATVMC.com. And this week we are going to discover how technology can take a big problem of rock crawlers and how expensive they are and get you into the sport in a much smaller way. Well, next week's show looks as much fun as we had today. It's gonna to be a great time. Oh, it sure is. You know, this is a place you really need to come out and explore. So if you're at all inclined for motorized sports, dirt bikes or anything like that, you need to come out to Tooele County. You know what's amazing to me is that you never think about how beautiful and how close these mountains are to Tooele. That's true, and, and you know, it's, it's, not, it's not sagebrush and salt up here. No. It's beautiful green. Gorgeous, man. It looks like you're in the Alps. So, like we say every single week, and it's true this week too, there is adventure around every single bend. But you got to get out and create your own adventure at, at your, your leisure. leisure. All right, now, it's not leisure time, it's work time. Lo load it up. we got to strap this thing down. There is adventure around every single bend. And it's up to Darren <laughs> to go out and discover it at your leisure. I'm like, where is he going with that one? All right. Um...